New York gun owners seeing some changes today. The state's new gun laws are now in effect. The new laws restrict where somebody can carry a concealed weapon and update the process of obtaining one of those licenses. But these changes not coming without some challenges. Capital correspondent Jamie DeLine has more. You may be seeing signs like this one that's been posted in the state capitol building now that New York's new concealed carry law is in effect. Under this new law, those with concealed carry permits are not allowed to bring their guns in areas that are deemed sensitive locations, such as government buildings, schools, and restaurants that serve alcohol. The new law has already faced a legal challenge in New York's Northern District Federal Court by the Gun Owners of America, who wanted to stop it from taking effect. Late Wednesday night, Governor Kathy Hochul announced, quote, the court dismissed the case and denied the motion for a preliminary injunction. It is a just and right decision. Lawyer Derek Hogan explains the judge's ruling. Nobody's been harmed by it yet. Nobody's been denied entry into a certain business because of the new law or nobody's been denied, let's say, a pistol permit application because of the new law because the new law hadn't taken effect. But just because the new law is now in place doesn't mean legal battles are over. It was passed in response to the Supreme Court striking down New York's previous concealed carry law earlier this summer. Now, the New York State Rifle and Pistol Association, the same organization that won that major case, plans on challenging this law as well. Our lawsuit, after everything has been settled and discussed, our lawsuit is going to be filed either later today or tomorrow. Reporting in Albany, I'm Jamie DeLine. Turning our